Okay, guys, so today is Sunday, and um, this is, tomorrow is the beginning of my, of our um, Tobo Fire 90 Days Challenge. I'm going to add my waiting today to this video, um, but I'm not going to do a body shot. Like I told you before, my 100 pounds is soon approaching, and I will, I'm going to take body shot pictures today dated but I'm not going to do it put it up until my 30 days where I will compare it at that point because everybody know that you know I'm about as soon as my 100 pound hit whether it be now or before the 30 days is up I will do a full body shot then so that's why you're not getting a body shot I begin a body shot now um that's my wife changing the channel on the TV <laughs> Anyway, so she's supposed to be joining us for this turbo fire when she gets on because, you know, she's always gone, working hard. Um, so whenever she has the available time, we're gonna, she'll be in the videos with us doing the turbo fire and trying to get it off just the same. And from time to time, you will see different clips of my food that I'll be eating because, you know, I'm really trying to get this cooking thing together so my food won't be bored. I hate boring food. Um, and as you will see after this, incorporating that, um, what do you call it? The shake wave for this. Everybody keep asking about this. I have that, guys. You see that? If I put my arm like this, you're not going to see it. But when I put my arm like this, it's there. You know, when you lose that amount of weight, as I have, and other people that's losing weight, it, it's, some people are lucky. My wife's arms is tight. You know, my my arm is not tight. I'm not that lucky. And some people have that skin that can come back. And mine is not one of them. So, if anybody want to give me a little surgery out there, I'm willing to take it. No, I'm just playing. But no, I'm serious. So, anyway, so I'll see you guys tomorrow with my turbo fire. I hope you enjoy the shake weight. And um, I'll give you my weight in this video. This is your girl Trini, a.k.a. You know who. Peace. Two sets of 30 second exercises with two sets of recovery, active recovery sets. You want your feet shoulder width apart, knees slightly bent, hips balanced, chin out. With this exercise, you're combining your biceps, triceps, and forearms. Shoulders are all engaged. Remember, six minutes with the shake weight burns as much muscle energy as 42 minutes with the standard dumbbell. Good job. Keep it going. Four, three, Two, one, into the active butterfly recovery stretch. Good job. Keep your breathing nice and steady. One, switch hands with the shake weight from left to right. Let your muscles recover in this 30 seconds. Now you're just getting the blood flow all throughout your upper body. Get ready for the next set. Second set, we're going to use the same stance in all these exercises. Feet shoulder width apart, knees slightly bent, hips bounced. Good job. You should be feeling a really good pump by this point. Keep it going. Intense strokes. The shoulders are burning, biceps are burning, triceps are burning, forearms. Good job. Come on, let's just keep it going. Five more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Shake it off, get ready for your next exercise. Good job. Now we're going to go into the second exercise, the single arm exercise. We're going to do two sets, 30 second exercises with two sets of active recovery also. You want to keep the arm in the L position. Upper arm is parallel to the ground. Forearm is vertical. Shake weight should be at an even plane. We're going to use the same stance, feet shoulder width apart, knees bent, balanced at the hips. As you can see, biceps are activated, 
triceps and the forearms. Keep the shake weight going, keep the momentum going. Come on, you can do it. Good job. Now we're going to go to the active recovery stretch. Arm all the way up, all the way back down. Let your muscles relax, get the blood going. Get ready for set number two. Good job. Keep your breathing nice and steady. You want your hand all the way up to the top, all the way down. Like a little shoulder press stretch. Bring it all the way down. And you want to do this in two sets of 30 set interval of your active recovery stretching. This allows you a chance to get recovered into your next exercise. Now we want to switch hands, go on to the left hand, do the single arm exercise on the left side. 30 second set again. Same stance. You want your arm in the L position. Keep the shake weight at even plane. Good job, Matus. Keep it going. As you see, his bicep is now activated, triceps, forearms, shoulders also are included. You want to decrease the wobble, keep it nice and steady with good strokes. Remember, a slight shake will energize your bicep muscle, creating as much as 240 reps per minute. Good job. And you want to do this active recovery stretch to let your arm recuperate. Get ready for the next exercise. Stretch all the way to the top, all the way down to the bottom. You want to do this for 30 seconds. Allow your muscles to recuperate, get the blood flow going, get ready for the next exercise. You want your hand all the way up to the top, all the way down, like a little shoulder press stretch. Bring it all the way down. Good. Shake it up all the way. For the third exercise, we're going to do the reverse tricep exercise. We're going to start off with your left hand over your right. We're going to use the same stance, feet shoulder width apart. Knees bent, hips balanced. As you can see, you're going to start engaging the triceps. They're going to start really burning at this point. And you, your, your stomach, his core is also active at the same time. You really want to concentrate on your triceps right now. You're going to feel a big burn in your triceps. Good job. Keep it going. Five, four, three, two, one. Into the active recovery stretch. Give up your muscles a chance to relax. Get the blood going. Good job. Keep your breathing nice and steady throughout this whole process. You want to do this for 30 seconds. Allow your muscles to recuperate, get your blood flow going. Arch your arms all the way to the top, all the way down, switching the shape weight from left to right. Now you're just getting the blood flow all throughout your upper body, getting ready for the next set. For the second set, we're going to put your right hand over your left, doing a standard reverse tricep exercise. We're going to use the same stance, Feet shoulder width apart, knees bent, hips balanced. Engaging your triceps. At this point, you're going to be really fatigued. You guys are really going on this one. Come on, Matus. Really burn the triceps. Good job. You should be feeling a really good pump by this point. Keep it going. Intense strokes. Feel the burn. You got it? Come on, let's go. Five, four, three, two, and good. Into the active recovery stretch. Arch your arms all the way to the top, switching the shake weight from left to right. You're going to do this for 30 seconds. By the end of those three exercises, you're feeling a really good pump. You're building your definition, your muscle, all your shoulders, biceps, and triceps. For a more challenging, advanced workout, you can try the full upper body burnout. On this one, you're using the same stance as before, same technique. You're just going to go to your body completely fatigued. Keep it going. Fast and fishing strokes. Good job. Keep it going. Come on. Now you're going as fast as you can, as hard as you can, until your body can't take it anymore. Activating your core, your shoulders, your triceps. You've already done the three previous exercises. So by this time, just give it all you've got. Keep it going. Now you're completely pumped. You're going from side to side, left to right, right to left. For 30 seconds. Keep it going. Good job. As you can see, his abs are active, his obliques are working, shoulders, triceps, and forearms. Good job. Five, four, three, two, one. Good job. We go to the T. Move the shape from left to right. It's activating your abs, your upper body, your chest, and triceps. It's all inclusive. This is a very fast movement, and you're going to burn out. Keep it going. Good job. As you can see, the abs are, the abs are firing, the shoulders are, the biceps, the triceps. The legs are actually going too. Lower abs. Come on, keep it going. The 
Hey guys, okay, so you see, um, we doing the shake wave. We are gonna um, incorporate that in to our top of fire and um, to tighten the flap in the arms because a lot of people have been asking about that. And um, um, I have flap under my arm. My arm is not tight. It all depends on how I hold my arms. If I put my arm, my arms on my waist, it comes up. But if I just let my arms hang, my arm, it really hangs. There's a lot of loose skin under there. So um, one of the things we're gonna do is try the shake wave and see how this go. It, I could tell you, the six minutes, it's very intense, it's a very intense workout. Um, trust me, you're gonna feel it, it's no joke. All right, so this is gonna be added to everything else. See you in a bit. <laughs> 